water. It covers about 70% of the earth. It makes up more than half of the human body. It's one of our basic needs to survive. However, recently, Middle Georgia State University's Cochrane Campus has experienced issues with their water. Back in the spring of 2016, over 15 parts per billion of lead was found in the water of several buildings on the Middle Georgia State Cochrane Campus. Unlike the other Middle Georgia State campuses, the Cochrane Campus has its own water system. The university's residence life director explains how a solution was crucial in this situation. When the problem was diagnosed, that they jumped on it. We had to post some things around uh, in the buildings to let students, faculty, and staff know, uh, and the plant jumped on it. Even though the university was in a state of crisis and confusion, Middle Georgia State worked diligently to find a resolution to the water issue. New filters were installed in the Georgia Hall cafeteria. A town hall meeting was held to reassure students that the problem was under control. Middle Georgia State officials tracked the amount of lead parts per billion regularly. Although the university found resolutions to the water, students asked the plant director how certain amounts of lead could infiltrate our water system. Pipes can't have lead in them, and they do. Like, you know, some of these uh, service pipes going to and from buildings are very old. Um, they possibly, you know, and they could have, um, that's where they're coming from. The lead is coming from pipes, not from uh, our groundwater, which is lead free. The current state of the water has improved on the Middle Georgia State Cochrane Campus. All of the building's water is below 15 parts per billion. I'm Nikea Conyers, and this is Night Vision News Cochrane.